artists, welcome back to Bellify channel. I am Anna and I'll try to make this video as short as I can. How to draw a 3D? Well my friend, you can do this by adding shading to your drawing. By varying the levels of shadows and darkness, you can alter the depth perception of an illustration to give it some 3D effect. With these drawing steps, you can learn new pencil shading techniques and improve your drawings. Decide which shading technique is best for you. You have three amazing shading techniques, hatching, stippling, and blending. So here we have hatching. This is a basic drawing technique used to create a shading effect on a piece by drawing parallel lines close to each other varying the length, angle, closeness, and other qualities of the lines. A stippling, used in small dots, is another way of shading drawing. The denser the dots are, the darker the shade. And then we have blending. By using this method, an artist is capable of creating a smooth transition from light to dark. Here I show you a scale of value. In order to shade more realistically, an artist will need to range from light to dark. The amount of pressure you add to your pencil will determine how dark a shade will end up being. Understanding light's behavior and being able to properly print this into paper will mark the difference for the quality of your drawings and how realistic they look. Identify half tones and highlights. Core light. Areas in the core light are facing light directly. Highlights. Areas in the highlight are reflecting the source of light. You can see here the brightest areas. Half tones or mid tones. Areas where light starts to fade into darkness. as much as you wish to improve. Continuous improvement is better than delaying perfection. Mark Twain. That wasn't me. Mark Twain. Learning how to shade or how to draw in general requires a lot of time. Challenge yourself, play with lights, try different pencil drawing techniques. Practice will be the main factor for improvement while you're learning how to shade drawing. So go on and bring out the amazing artists you have inside. If you have no idea what to draw, you should go to our social networks because you'll find amazing and inspirational pictures. So I'm gonna be leaving the links down below. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you later.